you know. Mm -hmm. And they never did call me. You know, they was cutting, they was calling the veterans down to give them an examination. It was shutting them, it was cutting them off because they found they had improved and, uh -huh. and, and, and it, it wasn't eligible for the disabilities they was getting, you know. So I was hoping they never did call me. Mm -hmm. And when I got married, I should have gone down to the VA to tell them that I was married so they could have had my wife on. But I didn't want to be, be examined, so I didn't, I didn't go down. So I needed my DD-14, and I had to go down to pick that up. And the guy was interviewing me, he was asking me, are you married? And I said, yes. He said, why haven't you come down? So they made it retroactive three years back and uh -huh. brought it up and, and added on. It wasn't that much, but it was, it was enough to buy gas and everything, let's put it that way. And I have had no contact with them since. I get letters from them, you know, mm -hmm. and that's all. So every money, and it's direct deposit, so it goes into my credit union mm -hmm. once a month. That's it, so I have no, no regrets. Mm -hmm. And really, this haven't bothered me from the day I left this summer. Shortness of breath, and but it's sensitive though. It's still right now. You know how people walk by and they goose you a little bit. Oh man, I come around swinging. I, I tell people, don't goose me now, hey, because it's still sensitive. Yeah. You know? And uh, and you, but they don't uh, call you back for a physical. Or right. They haven't like called that. me back in all these years now. <laughs> Forty, for fifty and years. And you didn't have any trouble. Um, breathing or anything no like that? No trouble at all. No trouble at all. That's it. So what would you um, say about your um, army life? Uh, what did you learn from being in the military? Well, really, I learned how to... The army teach you a lot of things, you know, to learn how to deal with people and help each other. I mean, it, it was just a, a whole learning experience, you know. Mm -hmm. I always have that along with people, but, but still, the, the Army is, is, is a different field from, from the average outfit that's out here, you know. Mm -hmm. And I had some good training because we go to classes and they tell you how to survive in strange countries and different terrains and weather and, and all this, you know. So. I, I learned a lot. Mm -hmm. it, it keep your mind sharp. Mm -hmm. So, really, that was a good start for me. Start off in the army, mm -hmm. and, and it really laid a good foundation for myself. And I put it to good use all these years. So mm -hmm. I have no regrets. So that's positive. That's a positive. Uh, that's it. Uh, right. Attitude. That's good. Uh -huh. And did you, um, well, you had your jobs, but you could have gone to, uh, to school on the GI Bill, couldn't you? To, right, but you see. You were happy with it, right, what that, you were doing. It, right, that's it. I was happy with what I was doing. And like I said, I could have gone, but back th at that time, I wanted to go to college, but I, I didn't look into it and didn't follow it up, you know. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to go to work and get some money. The first thing I tried to do when I got here is try to get a job with the telephone company. They wouldn't hire it. So that was out. So that just, that's why I started finding something. I went to Floyd Rice and got a job there. And, hey, I have a job now. I'm going to stick with it. Mm -hmm. And it made a good living for me, really. Because right. back at that time, let's say in 55, 56, I was making twenty thousand dollars in. That's a lot of money there. But like I say, I worked eight and ninety hours though. Mm -hmm. But I didn't mind working. You know? So it was a training thing. So mm -hmm. school was just out as that yeah. I, I was working. And, well, you and decide. You made a decision. Yeah, yeah. That's right. Right. Wanted to do, and you got married. Right. I got time. married in '69. Right, and I stayed married to the first wife of 18 years. Did you have any children? No, no children. at that time, no. Mm -hmm. And uh, built a house, had it built and everything. We, the thing got, got rough and I guess I worked too much and 